Hey guys, welcome to Sunday Bermuda. In today's video, we're going to start out in the backyard. And I'm going to give you a little recap of what I've done so far. Since my last video, I put Easy Wet down. I put the Easy Wet down and then I came back and, you know, my manual aerator was broken. My carburetor went bad only, so I had to take it out, clean it. But I decided not to use aeration, me me uh, mechanical aeration, because it is late in the season. So I did the Easy Wet and then I also came through and I turf raked it both ways. And boy, did I pull out some stuff. And then I came back the next day and put down some Simple On Solutions 1648. I put down the soil hume. I sprayed it really good. I mean, in fact, it, you might can kind of see where the brown is. It has a brown haze to it from that dark hume. I really, I did go pretty heavy on it. But so today I'm going to follow that up with, we got an inch and a half of rain. So it really soaked all that stuff, good stuff into the soil. Hopefully get down to the roots and Today I'm going to come back with some Simple On Solutions iron. So we'll go to the garage and I'll show you what I'm going to do on that. But on the way to the garage, I'm going to stop and give you an update on the front yard and show you what it looks like too. So let's head to the front yard. Okay, here we are in the front yard. It's looking really good. Really good. Got a mow in today. And again, it kind of has that brown haze to it from the humic, that heavy coat of humid I put down. So we're going to put down some iron as well on the front yard. So we're going to fill up my push sprayer and put the iron in it and get to spraying. And you can kind of tell, you can see some, starting to see some stalk pop up through it because it's getting late in the season. Here it is almost mid-September. And the four flags down there, you see that little white car. That is my test. I'm not sure if this video will come out first or that one, but I got some nuts edged down there. I marked them. I'm using four different herbicides. So keep an eye out for that video as well. So let's head to the garage. Okay guys, here we are in the garage. We got the simple grow solutions or simple lawn solutions, darker green. Here is the 32 ounce, this is the one gallon. But if you look at this 32 ounce, on the back it says to put roughly 32 ounces covers 3,200 square feet. And as you know, if you watched any of my other videos, you know that my backyard is 3,200 square feet. So I could actually apply this whole bottle on my just my backyard i could take this hose end off here i can put it on here and cover my whole 3200 square feet evenly but as you know i don't walk that fast it normally takes me two so if i wanted to use a hose end sprayer i could actually take half of this put it in here probably fill it up halfway and then fill the rest of up with water and then fill the rest of this one up with water and then put these on and cover the whole yard but i'm not going to do that i'm going to use my a little push sprayer here it's currently being filled up with water because i'm going to also do the front yard and i've got it pretty much calibrated in my slow <laughs> alabama walk i guess you could say to 10 gallons so basically six six gallons on the front yard four gallons on the backyard so what we're going to do is we're going to put the entire 32 square i mean 32 ounces for the backyard in there for that four gallons and then the other six gallons we're going to put I'll probably put about 48 ounces of this in here because one gallon is 128 ounces so there will be plenty in here. So let's fill it up and we will get to spraying. Always shake this stuff up good.
Okay guys, I'm gonna end this video, show you what it looks like. It's about five days out from putting down the darker green by Simple Lawn Solutions and it, boy, did it green up. Especially for this late in the season. It's looking really good. Oh, and I did find out what gives it that, <clears throat> why it's looking kind of brown or blackish in it. You can really see it right here. You can see right along that little curve where I've been real mowing this and also sprayed it. That's untreated. But that was Impro's uh, micro mix. It really stains the grass and turns it black almost. But look at that green. Even after that, the, the darker green with 6% iron, iron really did its magic. Oh, it looks good tonight. All right, guys, if you enjoyed this video, give me a thumbs up. Have you tried a uh, darker green in your yard? If not, give it a shot. Leave me a message in the comments. Let me know what you use to green up your lawn. What kind of iron? There are several brands out there. Be sure and subscribe. If you're not subscribed, give me a thumbs up. All right, guys, we'll see you next time. Hope you guys have a great day.